Hey guys, we are back. This is my client, Miss Janice, who has been doing hair 56 years. So you guys asked how she was able to um, sustain being in the industry for 56 years. So we're going to ask her. So how was you able to be in the business for 56 years, Miss Janice? Because I loved it. I loved what I was doing and couldn't do nothing else. So you love doing hair. You love and like doing hair. Right. Mm -hmm. So do you think that, I believe that to have longevity too is also about staying educated and right. going to classes. Because a lot of times what I realize is that a lot of people leave the industry because they aren't evolving. In education. In, in education. Right. So. Keep up with the, when I was coming in, you know, new in the industry, I think that that's important. Keeping up with the new with the new things that comes along in the industry. Right. Hey Tiffany, hey Tina. This is my client, Miss Janice. She's telling us how she's been able to do 56 years in the business. She lived in Gary, Indiana, and had a salon for how long? I had the salon for 40, almost 50 years. Had the salon for almost 50 years. How many employees? How many stylists was working there? Uh, 25. 25 people. And and uh, five barbers. And five barbers. That's mm -hmm. a lot. But for 56 years in the industry, the simple thing she said was that she liked it and she, she liked, loved it. Right. That so, was it. That and, and, and keep up what's going on. Keeping up with the education. So, who is that? Hey, Tracy, how are you? Hey, Gail. So keeping up with education and it's something that she simply loved. Hey Elaine, yeah, wow, absolutely Gail. <laughs> That's what I said. And when she told me she had a salon for almost 50 years, when we first, hey Brian, when we first um, met, I was like, you can tell me a whole lot of stuff. Let's talk. Hey Dee, how are you? Very pretty, thank you. So 56 years in the industry, and it's just simply because she loves it and she likes it and she stay educated. And right. she's not doing hair now, but she even she's got her license here and she still take classes. Right. But she well, I let me say this: she does her family hair. Right. So that's what she does. So they in my client cute y'all. Look at Miss <laughs> Janice. I love her. Let's see. Hello, Toya. I'm great. It was her passion. Yes. Yes, Gail. You definitely have to have a passion behind it. Hey, Lizane, how are you? I've been doing do since I was, what, uh, about five years old? She started doing hair at five. I don't even remember what I did at five. <laughs> With pop bottles and uh, you used to put hair on into pop bottles. On the... Y'all. Made hair. Made my own hair. <laughs> pop bottles, put the hair on the pop bottles, and made our own hair. Staying educated is the key, is what Elaine say. Yes. Cortez. Hey, Cortez, how are you? So if y'all have not, y'all, whoever just came on, you guys, catch the replay, because her ride will be here shortly. But I wanted to come back in like I promised. So her key things were just stay educated. It's her passion. She loved and liked what she actually does. So that's it in a nutshell. 56 right. years, almost 50 years in the, having her own salon with... 30 employees, Lord have mercy. Mm -hmm. I had six for 11 years, but it's just learning people's personalities right. and allowing them to be who they are and create a family and community and stay mm -hmm. communicating. Right. Her hair is beautiful. Gail said your hair is beautiful. Thanks. She said, thank you. <laughs> Let's see. Cortez said, oh, hey, hey, Cortez. So that's it guys so we will be back maybe we can drop some knowledge when she come back in two weeks if y'all got questions for somebody that's been in the industry for so long type the comments below and we'll come back on here next week just for a little chat hey danette hey for hey miss collins i'll be messing your name up lord have mercy i'm so sorry don't laugh at me because i know you're gonna put some emojis in there but that's it so if you guys are wanting to have longevity in the business such a blessing yes it is hey Hey, here I am. If you guys want to have longevity in the business, just make sure that it's a passion, something that you enjoy doing. And in a nutshell, I always say you got to like it and love it. Right. Compare the, marry the two together. And also, just staying educated. So many times we don't stay educated, and that's why, hey, Maria, 
that's why a lot of times stylists fall out of the industry because they're not staying educated and they're losing clients just because they're not evolving with things that change. What's going on? So that's it. Thank you guys for coming in. We'll see you in two weeks. Put some questions down there. We'll come back on. Cortez says, tell her to stretch her hand on this screen and impart in us coming along. <laughs> I know that's right. I know that's right. So, guys, thanks. I love you guys. And we will see you in two weeks. But I'll be back on today. I'm going to post again. Leah, you know what time it is, Toya. Oh, Lord. You getting your hair cut? I see you. I saw you made an appointment. I saw it in my... It came on my... Um, my phone so i will see you soon leah and thanks guys i will be back peace out okay thank you miss janice thank you